The main thing is to understand that trauma is not the event. Trauma is the impact on the nervous system, right? So beautifully, trauma is not what happens to us, but what we hold inside in the absence of an empathetic witness. So it's understanding that it's the impact on the nervous system and what gets held and not processed in the body. That trauma is a physiological event. It is not a psychological event. It's not, a, as Resna would say, it's not a character flaw. It's actually a very, very effective tool for survival. A lot of the work that we do in from a trauma-informed approach is to respect the intelligence of that physiological response. It's only through really bowing down to the intelligence of the traumatic response that we have the opportunity to receive its blessing to move forward and move on.